All right, 19 News now is continuing coverage on our storm damage and the communities that were just ripped by tornadoes. 19 First Alert meteorologist Jason Nicholas rejoins us now. He has a bird's eye view, Jason, of the damage there in Portage County. Yeah, Duff, pretty significant out here. We're in far eastern Portage County, about an hour or so drive southeast of uh, downtown Cleveland, where last night at about quarter to seven, an EF1 tornado hit the village of Wyndham. Wyndham's about uh, a mile or so down Main Street here. We're right off of Main Street, actually called Main Street. There's a cemetery there, then eventually a little bit farther down, you'll get Wyndham. Garrettsville is a few miles up uh, that way. I, I want to show you video here uh, from Drone 19 that we shot earlier this afternoon, showing you kind of, a, as Brian mentioned, a bird's eye view of the damage here, which is very significant. Several structures, homes uh, were destroyed here, some uh, completely uh, not even able to rebuild. A couple there are now condemned. Uh, and you see this from above. I mean, this is some incredible stuff. Uh, the tornado was on the ground for about six minutes, winds at 110. That's being, you know, somewhat conservative, though. That's what the Weather Service did estimate the winds at. I think about that, 110 miles an hour. That's a very strong hurricane. Uh, as far as our uh, tornado scale, the EF, Enhanced Fujita scale, that puts us at, at an EF1 tornado. But one mile per hour stronger would be an EF2. So this is borderline an EF2 damage. You know, sometimes, I'm not saying it'll happen this time, but sometimes uh, these are upgraded when they get more information or see a a little, a little bit more information too. So there it is from Drone 19. Amazingly though, when you look at this damage, I talked to a few folks that either you know got to their safe spot. Some folks weren't home. Uh, in fact, the building behind me, 170 year old house right behind me, uh, the woman who lives there, talked to uh, her son, she was having dinner up the street in Garrettsville last night during the tornado, thankfully for that, uh, because the tornado did a number on her house. Again, 170 year old house, imagine that. The one next door is, uh, is destroyed. That's gonna have to be knocked down, structurally unsafe, folks told me here. So all of this damage, Thankfully, nobody seriously injured. Uh, they say it's rare for any type of weather to come through uh, here like that because we sit in a little bit of a valley. Uh, so they, you know, you might think you're not in a higher hilltop, but it really doesn't matter with tornadoes and severe weather. Uh, no matter where you are, you can get hit with that. So uh, that's the latest out here in Eastern Portage County. We were on the air for this. That's why we treat tornado warnings so very, very importantly. It's a top priority of what we do at the TV station. We'll have a lot more here from Wyndham coming up at five and six.